God, like really, like no, no joke. This is just look at this. Look, look, absolute butter. Beautiful. This is the best thing I've ever tasted. I mean, that is just stunning. Look at it. Wow. Oh yeah. Okay, how you doing? So what we've got here is some lamb. What I've done is I've dug a hole. It hurt my back. We put this in with some lovely masala on it, wrapped it up, got it in, and buried it. And we've cooked it for like four hours, I think, in total. It is just the most amazing thing ever. That, not joking, look, look at that. It's just fallen off the bone. It is so tender. I mean, I can't explain how wonderful that is. That is really, really, I mean, it's just the best. Look at it now. This is the best method I've ever used to cook lamb. Wow. So, excuse me, by the way. So what I've done is I've got a whole lamb. I've got that in and we chopped it up. So what we actually cooked here is both the legs and both the shoulders. The rest of the lamb I've used for different things. But this... I just, yeah, wow, 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 we wow, wow. Welcome back to How To Cook Great. Okay, so this has just arrived. Beautiful, fresh lamb, whole lamb here. It's 10 kg, which is 22 pound. Let's get it open if we can. Look at that, fantastic. Beautiful. Nice and fresh, that just came in from the local farm. We're gonna cut that up. We're gonna cook that. I'm really happy with that, really nice and fresh that one is. Okay, and that's been prepared up. We just chopped that up. So, a couple of legs, a couple of the shoulders there. Here we've got sort of scrag ends, sort of bits and pieces. I'll use that for something else. Here we've got some long, ribs or chops. These are the ribs that didn't have a lot of meat on the end. You know, you get at one end of the, uh, the carcass, you won't get too much. So we chop that up and that'll be used for frying. That's the, the, the backbone, basically. That's a beautiful stewer. And we've got some lovely fat there. Really happy with that. Come on, hurry up, you're so lazy. It's yeah, keep going, keep going. There you go, so you need to dig a hole about half a boy. Can you keep still? Half a boy deep, I think. Thank you. Okay, great job, mate, you've done it, well done. I couldn't have done it without you. You're so strong. Now look, you see all that wood over here? We've got to get it all in there. So we're going to make a masala here or a mix of spices to rub onto the lamb. So I've got one cup of olive oil, one cup of lemon juice, one tablespoon of garam masala, one tablespoon of turmeric, one tablespoon of cumin, two tablespoons there of chopped garlic, half a tablespoon of chili powder, half a tablespoon of cardamom powder, salt and pepper, I think there's again about half a tablespoon of each and I've got some cloves there, maybe three teaspoons. Very simply, we're just going to get a bowl, get that in and give it a mix. So I've got my cup of olive oil in there. That will be joined by the same amount of lemon juice. Then we're going to go with those cloves, salt and pepper, green cardamom, chili powder, turmeric, cumin, 
garam masala powder and our garlic of course you can really adjust this to however you like we're going to give that a mix and that is what we're going to be rubbing onto that beautiful lamb so easy okay so this is the meat that we're going to use you saw the whole lamb and we cut it up i used most of it for different things but we've got the two legs and the two shoulders like that what i'm going to do is i'm just going to put a few cuts into them random cuts then we're going to get our masala rubbed all over Okay, so we're going to start with one piece of meat here. I've got some gloves on. You can see I just put a few cuts in there just to open it a little bit. I've got a large container because we're going to keep these in here and it gets a little bit messy. Just rub it all over the meat. And I'm going to do obviously the other pieces as well. Fabulous. So let me do the other bits and then I'll be back. But yeah, give it a nice rub everywhere. Beautiful. So yeah, nice little massage of the masala onto the, the lamb. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to wrap it up. I'll show you that process now. Okay, not a very exciting shot this, but the, what we're going to do is wrap the meat now. So I've got a, a layer here of aluminium or silver foil, whatever you call that. Next up, we're going to add a layer of cloth. Okay, another exciting shot. So on here, I've got some cloth. It's a muslin, or you can use like a sheet or something cotton, and it's wet. It's actually really wet, so you know, we'll need that for moisture. So layer of foil, then the cloth, wet cloth. Okay, so this is layer three. So foil, wet cloth, then here I've got some banana leaves. One more layer now of foil. Okay, and then one piece of our meat, I'm going to use a leg there. So we're going to cover it all now, fold it all in together as much as we can. And you don't need it like super tight. It doesn't have to be like really, really tight. In fact, leaving it a little, little bit of air in there is a great thing. And then what I've done is I've given it one more layer of foil. That's it, let me do the others. Okay, so we've got one, two, three, four pieces of meat wrapped up beautifully, ready for the fire. Okay, so we started that up there, nice small bits. I'm gonna chuck a couple of big logs on that as well once that cooks down a bit. Okay, so what we need to do now, now it's burnt down, we're gonna take out about a quarter of it on one side. Then we're gonna put the meat in and then put those coals back on.
Okay, so that's going to stay in there for about three and a half hours. Now, I find it quite important to do a nice deep hole. That was maybe deeper than you think, but I think it works out so much better with a deep hole with lots of sand on top or dirt back on top to compact it. See you in a few hours. It's hot here. We're going to get some water. Okay, so that's actually about four and a half hours, actually, not three and a half, like four and a half. So, a bit more hard work. Let's get digging. So this is the point where you have to dig really carefully now because we're near that point and it's really really hot it's not cooled down in any way it really does feel very very hot okay the moment of truth let's open this one up Okay, so let's do the fork test, shall we? Look at that, look at that. That is melt in your mouth. That is beautiful stuff. Let me taste that. That is stunningly good, stunning. Well, let's get the others out. Let's get that plated up. So was it worth digging that hole? You betcha, that is absolutely stunning. I mean, I'm not joking, look at that. It's just falling off the bone here. It's like butter, it really is the most delicious thing ever. Just look at that. I'm so, so happy with this. I really recommend that you do it. I'm gonna eat all of that, the whole lot. Anyway, look, I hope you enjoy that. Take it easy, be safe, be well. I'll see you soon. Lots of love.